I'm going to show you three side plank variations using the TRX. So first, adjust the handles to mid-calf. So the foot cradle is about at your mid-calf and the handle is below your knee. And then come down into all fours, hands and knees. When you place your feet in the foot cradle, so one in each, the foot cradle is actually going to be close to your toes. It feels like it's more stable to slide more of your foot in there, but if you go toward your ankle, it's less stable. So keep your uh, foot cradle, keep the foot cradle near your toes. And then you're going to come down into a forearm side plank. So drop your forearm to the ground, roll open into a side plank. Extend your top arm up to the sky. Keep those hips lifted, no sinking. You might stay right here and hold for time, or for reps, you're gonna scissor, slowly scissor, open and close the legs. And you may finish 10 to 12 repetitions, working on stabilizing through the whole rest of the body as you open and close the legs. And then come on back down into all fours. So the next more challenging variation, you're gonna place your, what would be your top foot, what's gonna be your top foot into both foot cradles. So top foot into both foot cradles. And then again, roll into a forearm side plank, elbow on the ground, lift up into that side plank, extend your top arm and float the bottom leg. So a little bit more challenging here, you might be holding, or for reps, move your bottom knee in and out slowly and then come on down. And the third and last most challenging variation, instead of the top foot, put your bottom foot in both, crate, in fo in both foot cradles. So place your bottom foot in both foot cradles. Again, roll into that forearm side plank, extend your top, leg up, top arm up to the sky. You might be holding this leg, floating, pressing down into the bottom leg to hold yourself up, or for reps, move that top leg in and out slowly, go for 10 to 12 repetitions, come down and rest before switching to the opposite side.